All right, so I'm just the York stupid dog. The one thing I wanted to say is that this, I, I'm a fool, I'm an idiot, but I have certain levels of perception because death is breathing down my neck and I have dog remembrance, which allows me to access memories that aren't even my own from other sentient beings in the cloud above the canines, the canine cloud above. It's like the AI thing. It's like, you know, we can access memories of other canines, fellow canines, even before we were born. So it gives us a big, whatever you say, a big frame of reference. So this take is about Cat Williams and Ludacris. And Cat Williams is trying to say that Ludacris was a, a bought off, sold his soul to the Illuminati. That the Illuminati can, controls Ludacris. And Ludacris signed a... Uh, 10 million or 20 million uh, pitcher deal. He's going to make 200 million dollars. First off, Cat, you're pretty cool. I love you, but there is no such thing as the Illuminati. Okay, Bonehead. Everybody who thinks there's Illuminati, Joe Rogan, Tucker Carlson, Majority Taylor Green, Cat Williams. All the people everywhere that are kind of idiotic, stupid white people that think there's Illuminati. It's no such thing. It's a joke. It's a joke on you. Cat said that not only did Ludacris give up his opportunity to wear pointy sideburns, he sold his blackness to the Illuminati. Now, it gave me pause when you sell your blackness, because it's not that there's Illuminati, but there is a devil. I'm a stupid dog, and Cat Williams knows this. Cat, calling all cats. Cat, calling all cats. There is a devil. There isn't an Illuminati, but there is a devil. So just it's called the O.J. O.J. Simpson simplex. See, maybe Ludacris gave up a portion of his whiteness or he did something, something that nobody can quite quantify. It's called the O.J. Simpson's, whatever I said before, I can't remember. But so you give up your blackness, you marry a white woman. She's maybe not the prettiest white woman. Maybe you get so pent up, you're so screwed up that you wind up slicing throats, you wind up killing people. But you're in league with the devil because you're trying to be something you're not and you're denying what you are. Black is beautiful. You don't have to worry about it. It's beautiful. It's a wonderful thing to be black. Every little kid out there should be happy he's black if he's black. If he's not black, don't be a wigger, you know. If you're black, don't pull the trigger. If you're white, don't be a wigger. That's an old saying from the old days of the Reagan administration. If you're white, don't be a wigger. If you're black, don't pull the trigger and just say no. That's a Reagan-esque saying. Nancy, Nancy Reagan wrote that. But anyways, Cat Williams, I just want to be the first to tell you, Ludacris didn't sell his soul to nobody except for, I don't think he sold his soul to the devil, but, you know, the whole thing is he sold out to this, that. The other thing, he got a white wife. She wasn't that beautiful. The thing, there's an internal thing. It's the devil. It's not the Illuminati. The devil's creeping in. He's, he's crushing you. He's making you feel ashamed because you're a black man. It's just that simple. You're not screwed up. You're not bad. It's just that you think you've got to break away. You've got to shun your past. You've got to do away with your peoples. You've got to walk in a new direction. You've got to do all that stuff, but you've got to remember the behind. You've got to pull them along. You can't be ashamed you're black. If you're black, you can't be ashamed you're black. And there was another big point I wanted to say about something. I forget what it was. Something about what white people think or what white people this, that, or the other thing. I can't remember. But the bottom line is cat. Calling all cats. You're wrong. There is no Illuminati. And what Ludacris did is he denied his inner being. He denied his self. He denied his blackness. According to you, I don't even know if that's true. I'm just saying it's called the O.J. Simpson complex or whatever else I said. I mean, I'm a stupid dog, so I can't remember from one thing to the other. But you're liable to get really screwed up in the brainoid if you deny who you are. And if you deny who you are, you know, you might wind up being a sheep in sheep's clothing. You might be wind up being a wolf in wolf's clothing. You might wind up being a wolf in sheep's clothing. Or worst case scenario, you might wind up being a wolf. Or was it a wolf in sheep's clothing or sheep in sheep? I don't know. Anyways, you cannot deny who you are. 
And if you do, you're asking for trouble. I'm just a you know, stupid dog. And this would be like one of those things like, you know, this has been not a minute in black history. This has been a little lesson you get in between the cartoons. I'm not sure. But this has been a dog minute. This has been a dog minute. Whatever. Take it for what it's worth.